In tonight's Boomtown coverage, Florida's population is climbing. People are buying up homes and driving up costs. And women are refusing to be left out. New numbers show Orlando is one of the top cities for female home buyers in the U.S. So this Women's History Month, News 6's Amanda Castro is taking a closer look at the numbers and talking to one woman who made her dream a reality. Thirty-five-year-old Jessica Burns has always dreamed of owning her own home. For a time growing up, she remembers living in a renovated school bus with her parents and three siblings while they were in between homes. It was always kind of a thought of not having something that was my own, you know, like a room that was my own or a space that was my own. That dream, now reality. Last summer, she crunched the numbers and decided the time was right to buy her first home. I thought to myself, I'm not going to pay $1,600 in rent when I could have a house for less than that. Working with realtor Lindsay Hudson of Cregan Property Group to find this newly renovated three bedroom home in Orlando for $250,000. Helping first time home buyers get past um, that first hurdle of, you know, their expectations and the scariness of the market and this, you know, financial woes of can I do this is, um, is really rewarding. And more female buyers are entering into home ownership. According to data from the Home Mortgage Disclosure Act, which requires federal institutions to report public loan data, 24% of home purchase loans in 2020 were from female buyers in the Orlando, Kissimmee, Sanford area. Compare that to 21% nationwide. A new report from Inspection Support Network, which provides property inspection software services, puts Orlando in the top 20 most female home buyers in the U.S., along with Miami and Tampa, and Atlanta is at the top. It's a trend Hudson says is on the rise. I've helped um, several ladies that were owning their own properties already and are ready to sell and move. Um, I also have a few clients coming from out of state that are female that are just looking for, you know, they found a new job and they're kind of just trying out a new, a new place. For Jessica, she says the experience empowered her. I think that perhaps the uptick or the rise of women doing that is realizing I don't need to wait until I have this partner to do, you know, what I want to do or to buy a home. Adding she hopes her story will inspire others to jump into the market. This is, it's important to me for people and especially women to understand that it's a lot more approachable to do something like this on your own than you think it is. In Orlando, Amanda Castro getting results, New 6. To learn more about women homeowners and other stories highlighting Women's History Month at clickorlando.com slash Women's History Month.